Hello everyone, I'm Terry. This is my channel, Crafty Clefty. And um, I want to thank everyone for joining me. And I hope you enjoy this next craft I've got for you. And I'm going to be using one of these Dollar Tree decorations. It's got the light behind it. says thankful grateful blessed so I'm gonna redo this make it pretty I'm gonna paint and I'm going to put um, some green tissue paper inside here so the letters will glow green when you turn on the light and I hope you enjoy. I want to invite everyone to subscribe if you haven't. And um, let's get started. Now, I've got this tissue paper. Okay. And all you do is trace around trace around so you got the, the shape and then you will like put it <coughs> after you cut it out you're going to it, lay it on top and cut it in so it still covers those letters. I don't know if you can see that. And this one has been cut and now it doesn't have to be perfect because it's going to be on the inside and no one's going to see it. Now what I did, I don't have package tape all I have is the regular tape here and after I got it cut to almost the size I just took the tape and just taped all over it, the whole thing and then I cut the tape all around it so one side doesn't have tape on it the other side does and the light shines through nicely and this is the first part what we're doing but we're not putting this on yet this will be the last to put on the first to make but the last to put on and I put a T on top of both of mine so I know which end is the top. And now I'm going to be painting this. And I'm going to paint it, I think, an orange because the letters are going to be glowing green. Now, before you paint, put, use some painter's tape and just wrap it around the light inside. That way you're not going to get paint all over your light. And then after it all dries, you just take it off. It's regular painter's tape, so it shouldn't be a problem to take off. So this is ready to start painting. And um, I will um, start painting and um, I will be back in a moment. Hey, well, I did it again. I forgot to put the sound on again. 
The first part of the video I did a couple times and forgot the sound. So I forgot the sound on this one. Now I am in the middle of the painting and as you can see I am painting the inside and I'm not so worried about um, the side with the letters because we're going to glue the um, paper in here. But I am going to do the little edge because the edge will be showing. And I picked out orange and I'm just painting and I'm painting the edge also this edge and I'm just doing the edge right now and because the edge will show and I'll probably hot glue the paper on. And well, I'm going to finish painting this up. And then I'm going to put the glitter on. I don't have much left. But um, it's, I'm going to use it. I already used it for this one. As you can see, the glitter. Yeah, okay. And it's still wet. Okay, I'm going to get finished painting and um, we'll put the glitter on and then I will let the whole thing dry before we put the last part on. Now, I'm done painting. I just put on one generous coat and I'm sure that's probably all that's going to be needed and I am going to put on some glitter just a little pinch and just kind of working it around I like glitter, so it says nice. Now, um, if your paint kind of clogs up, like the little, um, you can see. little area here now the paint clogged it up but I just took a small paintbrush and poked it in that little hole so the light can shine through and This one's a little bit more spotty than the other one, but I think it should be okay. Yeah, I think that should be okay. Now, after this dries, I'm going to, I'm going to glitter on, so after this dries, I'm going to be taking off the painter's tape from around the um the lights the low T lights then <coughs> I will start putting these on and for these I'm just going to use hot glue and I've got my little T for the top I showed you that earlier that way I know exactly the placement 
in, hopefully. It's going to turn out really good. And it's something simple that you can make with your kids and um, or as a group. And something fun. So, um, I'll see you later once this is all dry. And we'll start the next um, segment. So, don't go away. Now I'm things dry and now it's time I took off the one from here. Now I gotta take off the painter's tape from this one and it should go really easy. Just keep pushing. Uh oh. Well, I thought it was going to be easy. Um, you do the top. That's why I pushed it down and pushed it down like that. Maybe that's why I'm having the problem getting it off. Okay. The edge. The edge should be here. Okay, I got the edge. I'm pulling. I'm doing is pushing it with my finger. In here. And there's pushing. I'm pulling. Now it's off. Now, I've got my hot glue going. It's plugged in. And now the sign with the tape is going to go on this side. And let's see. I'm going to do it like this. And just shove it on through. I gotta find my key for top. Thinking, yeah, right there. And this is how it's going to look. And I am going to start hot gluing. Okay, finger protectors. Okay. Now, you don't have to have this on too much. I'm just going to lay it down and put it on this way. The hot glue on just a little bit. I'm gonna press that down. Now, and bring this up. I'm gonna put the hot glue just above those letters and press it down. Hot glue again, just above the letters. Got one more side. Now I'm doing it. At least you can't see. We'll be hot glued to the bare spot just above the letters. And remember, finger 
protectors for this. And up here. It's not hot anymore and dries pretty quick. And let's get the other one on. Find my tea and unfold it like this and put it inside. it on and you want to have it so the green part is not showing let me make sure yes that's my tea that's the top and we can start and now that's on make sure it covers the whole thing we're going to lay it down Put our finger protectors on. And can't really see too well. This on. Okay, got to do this side here. Now, just above the letters. Here, I've got in between the letters, so I've got plenty of room here. Push it down. Okay, just above the letters. Don't need much. Okay. Let's push it down. Now I got, I must have cut it wrong because I'm sticking up here. And maybe I laid it down wrong, I don't know, but that's okay. No one's going to see it anyway. Now, I got this here, just a little bit. And this here, and this is a handy tool. the lights back here and the knob back there and see how it looks and let's see Okay, now I'm going to post that. Thank you so much for joining me. This was a fun project, and I hope you have fun making one of these or something like it. And um, I'll um, see you later, and thank you for joining me.
If you haven't subscribed, I invite you now to subscribe. And thank you. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.